Hello guys, if you want to figure out how this Sprout Social works, you are in the right place. I'm going to be covering just the basics here into Sprout Social so you can start uh, working here. This is a tool that can help us to manage our social media, our own projects. Um, there are a bunch of stuff that we can do into Sprout Social. This also works as Monday. As a Trello, there are a few other applications, but in today's video, I'm going to be just focusing into Sprout Social. And of course, I'm going to be leaving you guys a link down below in the description so you can get a full access of a free trial of a specific plan for Sprout Social so you can figure it out if this application uh, might be filling all your needs. So once you click into the link down there, it's going to be appearing something like this. We just want to focus here into the in the part of the standard so it wants us no credit card required so once you click in there it's going to be available the free trial mode so in that free trial mode i just want to add my first my last name an email address and a passcode so once i enter a passcode let's see i'm going to be choosing this passcode and then i'm going to hit into enter in order to continue now uh, the great part about the Sprout Social is it can, in order to continue, we can um, import a Twitter profile, you can connect a Facebook page, or you can connect any other networks uh, later. But in my case, what I want to do is to use a Facebook page, because my Facebook page, let's say, is a page with my business and my brand, and I can import all the insights into Sprout Social. So I don't have to input my numbers, the audience and all that, which I think it's really, really great. So that's the reason why you want to take advantage of the free trial mode. So I want to choose Facebook page. Of course, you want to have your Facebook already opened. In my case, what I do want to use, what I want to choose is the continue. And here's going to be appearing all my pages. I only have one, I think. So I'm going to hit into continue. I want to accept the requestment here. And I want to choose my my page, which is sounds good store. We hit into select and hit into connect. All right, so now we've successfully connected here into Sprout Social from Facebook into Sprout Social. Now, if you want to connect more profiles, like your Instagram profile, like your LinkedIn, uh, a TikTok, even a TikTok profile, you can do that. This is just for um, let's say that you are an influencer, or you are managing a few, a few influencers, so. We, we do have four profiles remaining in the current plan because this is only like this standard plan so we can add something more but I just want to focus into the first one I want to show you the really really the basics here in, into Sprout Social so speaking about uh, let's get um, to know each other what I want to do is to choose the organization which in my case is sounds good how many people work in there I want to work for two out of ten employees we are located in Mexico City. This is the time zone and the preferred language. I'm going to hit into next. And this is actually not so important. I'm going to hit into finished. We can fill that later. I just want to show you the basics here. So for example, we do have the get started section. Uh, of course, these socials will be helping us a lot of a walkthrough. So we can start working in here and you can understand what you can do here into Sprout Social. But in my point of experience, I'm pretty sure like the most common tool that you're going to be using into Sprout Social is the task section. So if I use this bar where I can see all the tasks that I can use, all the tools that I can use, I want to focus in the tasks. And as you can see, I have my open task, right? So how teams stay on task. Here, what I'm going to be choosing, I can be creating tasks and I can assign that into, into my team. So what I can do, I'm going to hit into like, let's go here. And once I am in here, I'm going to go back into task here because it just uh, sent me back there. So here I have a new post, right? So if I post in here, what's going to happen is that I can schedule a post like if it was from the meta business suit and it's going to be sending that right away. Current profile that I'm using, which in my case is Facebook page. So what I want to do is to say this is a demo post. What do you want to post this? Let's say immediately go into send and post has been sent. If you want to make sure that this actually works, you want to go into your Facebook, you want to have this already opened. 
I do want to focus only in my main profile, which is this one. This sounds good. And as you can see here, it is. this is a demo post. So why is that? Because we already granted access to the application on our Facebook page. So we can manage that in there. So speaking about the tasks here, this is the feature of a 30 day remaining of a free trial. What I thought I just sent to you guys. So in here is going to be assigned a task that uh, we either we assigned tasks to our members or some member assigned some tasks for us. So in here is going to be appearing all the tasks that need to be done, right? So here into the next part, we do have the notifications, the team conversations, the shared links, connect to profile, invite a member, Twitter search, and keyboard shortcuts. So if I choose this option, it's going to be appearing all the links that I've showed so far with my team. And I can go into the publishing section so I can see all the publishing stuff that I sent it using the calendar um, looked of the grid of my publishing. I can choose draft here and I can start a new draft. If I want to create, let's say, like a post and someone else is going to be adding the media and schedule the time. So I'm going to go into the X button. And now what I want to show you guys is the listening part. So here into the listening part, this is actually something that I think I haven't seen in any other place. But this is something that's going to be helping us to listen or let's say put attention what does the audience has have to offer to our social medias here. So if I go into template, for example, and I want to look for campaign analysis. I can request a demo just I can show you what's going to be happening here. What's going to happen here is that the application automatically is going to be receiving all the uh, elements, all the conversions, all the engagement, the leadings of an ad that I just started into the sound, into the Sprout Social, so I can see if it's working or not. So as you can see, this is some preview. As you can see, we have the total volume. Uh, how many people looked at this? Uh, at least how many people looked at this uh, espresso ad, for example, the engagement, the average engagement. So what I want to do is to locate the potential impressions. So here into the potential experience, it could be showing me uh, how many impressions I had on a specific date. So total potential expression, click chart to view message. So I'm going to click in here. And here I can see what about the past? What happened with all the posts in here? So for example, I have 1000 likes in here. Down here, I just have 15 likes. So I think for me that it's in my case, it's better to just work into YouTube rather than Twitter. Or I need to work a little bit more into Twitter and see what I can tweet or, or what kind of content I can publish uh, more into Twitter. And I have to be like more aware of what I'm doing here into Twitter. And lastly, we always have the feeds. Here into the feeds, we do have our Twitter, our Instagram hashtags, our S, uh, double S reader. I think this is a thing for marketing research if you are working to the marketing field. Here, what you can do is to connect your Instagram account or your Twitter account. And here, what's going to be appearing here? It's like the most engaging content, the most engaging hashtags and posts that can be helping you to grow a little bit more your socials. So that's the reason why you want to take advantage of this great application called Sprout Social. Now, I once again, guys, I'm going to leave you a link down below in the description so you can get your 30 days free trial mode of the standard plan of Sprout Social. So hopefully this was a very useful video for you. Now don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about this great, great application. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Hopefully this was really useful for you and I will see you on the next one.